So great. So <clears throat> show you this beautiful jazz on using Timini's key. Sounds like this. This is on key C. Do it one more time. Okay, so this is it. Of your right hand, I'm going to show you what your right hand is playing and what your left hand is playing. Which one should I start with first? <laughs> This is the most simplest jazz I've ever seen. So, on key C, so your right hand, should I start with right hand or left hand first? Okay, let's start with right hand. So you're doing this. So this is the chord you're holding for right. This is your chord three. Your chord three, that's your note three. You convert three to a diminished chord. So this is E, so we're gonna play E diminished. No, E diminished. So just convert your three. Normally your three is a minor chord. But now we're going to play it as a diminished chord. Play your three as a diminished chord. Next one, play your six as a diminished chord. Then play your seven as a diminished chord. Always your seven is always a diminished chord. So you have three diminished chord, six diminished chord, seven diminished chord. Now what is the formula for getting a diminished chord? A diminished chord is your flat one. Is your one, flat three, and flat five. So eventually, if you're on key C, this is your C major chord. If you flat your three, you flat your five. You've gotten C diminished chord. So that's the formula for diminished chord anyway. So if you have your third degree of your scale, which is uh, on C, it is E, just play this. Just convert that and three to diminished chord. Convert your six to diminished chord. Convert your seven to a diminished chord on all keys. Now, when you play, it now sounds like this. So you're just striking two times. So the rhythm is one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. The next one. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. The next one. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You come back again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So four progressions. One, two, three. Then you come back. Then on your right hand, <clears throat> your right hand, you have the first one. The first one is like this. This is on key C. I'll still try it on other keys anyways. You see? So what, what are you playing? You're playing your... <clears throat> One, three, five, six, flat seven, six, five, three. So one, three, five, six, flat seven, six, five, three. Which is do, do mi sol la to la so mi. You go again. Do mi sol la to la so mi. Do mi sol la to la so mi. And you're playing it with the first one, which is your three converted to a diminished. So something like this. Wow. Beautiful. You see? Then the next one on your left hand, you're playing something like this. So you're playing four, six, eight, nine, flat ten. Nine eight six. So so far, note to be. Fa la do re mo re do la. Fa la do re mo re do la. Then you're combining the second one. Where you're playing your six as a diminished on your right hand. So you're doing something like this. Then the last one, you're now doing something like this. This one goes with your seven converted as a diminished. Your seven is always a diminished, anyways. So you're playing 
uh, which is so di re mi fa mi re ti do so di re mi fa mi re ti they combine it with your right hand it's gonna go in sound like this then you can now come back to your one so if we combine all of them it's going to sound like this next one next one Let's try it on key F and see how it sounds. On F sounds like this. And that is quite heavy, so something like this. So this side gives a, a kind of deep feel. This is on F now. Now let's try it on C sharp, then we'll try it on F sharp, and then we'll go to speed. So C sharp is going to sound like this. Let's go to a heavy octave. Oh, my, this thing is not covering that side, so let's start here. Now let's do for F sharp and we'll call it cool. So F sharp's got to sound like it. Uh, Now, when you do this, you can now develop speed. Let's go back to C. You can now develop speed and do something like this. Oh. Oh. See? Then you can do some spice up if you want, but I'm not here to do spice up. I'm just here to show you the grooves. You can do something like that. You can do spice up on that, but this is about maybe some other time I might show you how to do the spice up. But there you go, you've learned the most simple jazz on planet Earth. So, if you found this video useful, don't forget to drop a comment, tell me where you're watching from, and don't forget to share this video. Thank you very much. Bye.